it's a really boss scent like if you walk into the place everybody's gonna know like okay what, what you got on little lady Alright, hey you guys, it's the girl Katera and we are going to get into this video. Um, before we do, I just want to thank you guys so much. We're on the road to 1K. You guys can be anywhere, but you choose to click my video and watch it and I appreciate it and I don't take it for granted. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and let's just go straight into it. So this right here is Jazz Club. It's beautiful. I love it. I love it so much that I don't want to use it. Like, do you ever have like perfume or a fragrance like that? Like you love it so much that you don't want to use it or it costs a pretty penny. So you ain't trying to like use it. Well, this is it. So we're going to dive into the price point, why I like it, does it last long, all the great things. So sit back and relax. I got to have my handy dandy notebook right here with me. Um, just to inform you guys. So it comes in three different sizes. Um, the first one you have is the one ounce, which I have, which is $76. And I think this is good enough. It really is. Like, as much as I love it, I would never go and get the full size, which is... What's the full size? I want to make sure. The 3.4, I think it's too much. Like, it's really big. But then again, that's totally up to you. Like, the only reason I would get the 3.4 is if I really want to go ham and like... Which, now that I'm thinking about it, is not too bad because this is a really good pairing fragrance. Um, so the 3.4 is $144 and then the 1 ounce is $76 and then they have the travel size which I believe is either 50 or 68 because they have the travel size where it comes in like the set of 3 which has like fireplace, um, it has jazz club and something else. I'm not really sure about the other one. With that being said, the main accords are tobacco, sweet, rum vanilla woody aromatic soft spice amber warm spicy and powdery so if i mention all of these and you like it run to your nearest sephora um coles um probably neiman marcus like things like that but i know sephora for sure run ahead and go get it so as you can tell these are very nice warm fall scents lovely for fall lovely for winter it'll literally carry you um, I pair this if you have the Fenty. It goes really well with Fenty. Era Paradox. Oh my gosh, I had that five times fast. Or is it Paradox Prada? I need to look at my thing. Yeah. I'm looking at my stand where all my perfume is. So if you don't know how the Paradox Prada smells or the pair. How many times am I going to say it? If you don't know how the Paradox Prada smells, I have a review um about that so you can click the link below and it's really good i really really love it it was my first fragrance by prada and i'm not mad about it but we ain't talking about that we talking about replica honey so for me um it's let me show you guys how it looks oh my gosh can't believe i didn't do that okay so that's what it looks like really cute that's the top okay that's how much i've used so far bam okay so on it it says originally jazz club province and period is Brooklyn 2013. The fragrance description is heady cocktails and cigars. And the style description is a memory in a fragrance. So if I spray this, let's spray it around right now. I'm not wearing anything. Did it for the video. Oh my God. It takes me back to four when I sprayed. I was like, I want it. I got to have it. So for me, this does last long. It lasts very long. I love it. I do get compliments on it. Um, it takes me literally like to Harlem in Brooklyn. I have to close my eyes to like picture it. Like I have a cigar, but I coughed because <coughs> I don't really know how to smoke a cigar, you know, but I'm still in there looking cute, you know. Da, 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 da. Ba, ba, dum, ba, ba. Have you guys ever watched Life where they talk about the boom boom room? If you have watched Life, we're here. So you hit subscribe because we're here. The boom boom room. If you know about the boom boom room with Claude, go ahead and hit that. Go ahead and hit that like and follow button. Come on, we here. We here. So that's what it brings me to. It brings me to a Harlem night, a jazz club. It makes me feel like I'm sophisticated. Like I got my money. You know, my job is, you know, paying me on time. You know what I mean? Direct deposit. Everything's okay. You know, I got bills, but they're getting paid. It's a really boss scent. Like, if you walk into the place, everybody's going to know, like, okay, what, what you got on, little lady? Drinks all me. 
you know what i mean like it's kind of like that vibe like that gentleman over there he bought you a drink cheers so those are the notes if you like it go ahead run and get this it was launched in 2013 it is a leather fragrance for men but don't worry about that women we do what we want we wear what we want and there's a lot of females that have actually picked up jazz club I happen to be one of them but another youtuber kyra if you guys know kyra this is one of her scents that she loves and she pairs it with a lot of her different fragrances so you know i'm putting y'all on i have never steered you guys wrong and if you don't believe me that's okay just go to sephora and smell it yourself like hello so yes it is a leather fragrance if you're into leather like another one is tom ford ombre leather i've done a video on that too link below go ahead you know your girl's doing these videos go ahead so if you're into leather and you don't want to go Tom Ford route because Tom Ford is a little bit heavier. You can go with Replica. It's a little bit sweeter. It's like that sweet. It's like the introduction to leather. Um, it was launched in 2013. Like it says. It literally says period 2013 in Brooklyn. And then some of the top notes in here. Pink pepper, neroli, lemon. Middle notes are rum. Um, vetiver. Base notes are tobacco leaf, vanilla. And that's literally what you get. It opens up to me with that tobacco and that rum it settles down with the tobacco and vanilla you definitely get the vetiver and that pink pepper so everything that's in there you're literally getting but the first time i sprayed it i didn't really get leather i really got that tobacco that rum and that vanilla those are the three scents the three notes that i get that hit off to me the reason why i was like uh yeah excuse me guys i don't know if my voice is kind of shaky um <laughs> I've been doing a lot so you know I'm still fresh from the hospital not fresh from the hospital but you know once you've had COVID and pneumonia I don't know it's just kind of in there so excuse me if my voice is a little shaky and I'm breathing you know bear with me bear with you girl so like I said these are the notes that are in there I love it it lasts long I'm still smelling it on myself which I love um it's inspired by the scents wafting throughout a Brooklyn jazz club um with sweet notes that open cigar box old leather bar stools and fine age liquor so when you spray this this is kind of the feel that they wanted to give you and for me they did not miss that mark literally it makes me feel like i'm in brooklyn new york baby um once again another description is that it's a smooth cocktail of warm scents and spicy fragrance awakens with contrasting lemon and pink pepper followed by neroli oil rum and vanilla and topped off with a smoky leaf tobacco baby whoever wrote that did this okay so once again is it it's in the woody spice family warm and spicy and i told you guys the price point i told you guys how much it is i love it I, it lasts long you'll get your compliments this is one of the perfumes that you spray but you don't over spray okay it, it mixes well with different perfumes like i just told you guys the prada the fenty um and the gentle fluidity that they all mix together really well those are three that i've paired it with so far so i hope you guys like this video i wanted to keep it short and sweet and i'll see you guys on the next go around